And East Bay City will be celebrating 4th of July without its official fireworks show. Livermore City leaders say that the decision comes simply because there were too many people showing up and putting a strain on city resources. They're now offering a new way for residents to celebrate Independence Day. Our first Dan Thorne joins us live in Livermore tonight after getting some reaction. Dan, uh, we have a ways to go before the 4th of July, but do tell. Yeah, Vicky, still a few months away, of course. Yeah, it's not summertime just yet. Got to get through spring, but Livermore City officials say that they're not going to be doing nighttime fireworks on the 4th of July, and this is after thousands of people showed up last year and just essentially took over the city, according to them. So instead, this year, they're going to be doing a community-targeted event uh, during the daytime, and we caught up with some uh, city residents here who thought that maybe an influx would be good for the city and not having 4th of July fireworks fireworks is just not going to be the same. The 4th of July fireworks have fizzled out in Livermore. In a video shared on Facebook, the city says after more than 12,000 people showed up last year, neither it nor the Livermore Area Recreation and Park District can handle the influx this year. Our event's growing popularity has made it clear that the city or LARPD simply do not have the resources or infrastructure such as roadways and parking, to ensure a safe family event that our community can access. City Manager Mariana Marishiva also pointed out that last year, more than half of those people who came for the event were not from Livermore. The flood of visitors took over neighborhoods and traffic was snarled with people trying to find parking. Police Chief Jeremy Young says with streets being clogged, it makes it difficult for emergency vehicles to get around. Additionally, there was a high level of frustration from those stuck in traffic and those who live in the areas impacted by the crowds. Some Livermore residents say they were surprised by the city canceling the fireworks show. They figure the city would want a lot of people to come. Why would you not want to bring people and things to the city here and have the city make more money off of that? Well, why wouldn't they want business in town? The other issue for some is not celebrating Independence Day with fireworks at night. The city is instead proposing a family-friendly daytime event at the Livermore Municipal Airport. Ralph Downing says that's not the way it should be. Like everybody wants fireworks. I mean, that's, that's the 4th of July. That's the whole point of the 4th of July. Well, not the whole point, but I mean, one of the things that family, friends, kids look forward to is fireworks and, and an event. Well, city leaders say that they're also looking into some neighborhood events as well, and we're expecting more details on all of that in the coming weeks. Live in Livermore, Dan Thorne, Cron 4 News.